Hey guys, this is a brand new power book. Or not brand new, but brand new to me. Doing the leopard intro. One point six seven gigahertz G four. Seventeen inches. I've seen this intro in so long. do the so I could burn the disc to install them at work right now. Jeez. Mac OS 10 includes a built-in screen reader called VoiceOver. If you know how to use VoiceOver, press Command F5 now to turn it on and set up your Mac. If you would like to learn how to use VoiceOver to set up your Mac, press the escape key. So this is pretty cool. Um yeah early I don't know if it's early 05 or, or what, but. Okay, so. I just got it on eBay. Of course, used, quite used, as you can see. Rubber feet are broken. Um, I paid 200 for her. She said 2005, not a 2006, or the last, this is the second to the last of the power books. Still has the top of the line 1.67 gigahertz G4, which is the fastest you could get in a laptop for a power PC. Um, so I just installed Leopard. It was a pain in the ass because I had to burn a, probably six or seven dual air discs trying to get it to work. Uh, I had a um, I had a torrent that I downloaded. It finally worked through transmission. And um, this infographics shit. So, let's see. I only found a torrent. I don't know. I mean, if y'all if y'all need the torrent for Leopard, let me know in the comments, and I'll um I will send you that link, and I'll put it in the description or something. So, I had originally downloaded this one, which was only seven point two gigs for some reason. I get this crap to focus this iPhone. Um, and I downloaded this one for the second time. This other one here, and this one's 8.43. This one downloaded quick. This one downloaded pretty quick too. I got that one off the Pirate Bay. I think I got this one off of archive.com. Um, so let's see if I can find it. So yeah, this is on archive.com, art.org actually. So, I'll see if about putting this link in the description for y'all, if y'all are interested. I went down here, and I was going to download it straight out of the website, but it was going to take forever. So of course I went to the torrent, and this torrent was very, very quick. This is awesome. Um, it looks like they've got everything here, from Snow Leopard to Puma, Puma or Tiger, everything, from Mac OS 8. So this is pretty cool. Um, this is an awesome website, great website. But either way, back to what we were talking about. Um, burned a disc, installed Leopard, it had Tiger on it. Um, so, now I put Leopard on it. I had to wipe the hard drive because it, it, the install, I literally did this install like three or four times. It kept messing up, um, missing packages. And so finally I downloaded that torrent there, the last one, and it, it worked perfectly. First time I burned the disc the first time. Um, it ran the disc, both of them burned it perfectly, ran it perfectly with no issues. Um, downloaded the ISO, put it on the desktop, it's right here. And what I did was, because they changed disc, um, disc utility, it's not the same as it used to be. So I just went to burn disc image here. Uh, so, I'm excited about this. I'm going to get her working. And, um... Then Mac I'm going OS 10 try and make a another video about this. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. And hopefully I will see you soon in the next video. Once I get this thing working the way I want it to. Just let me know if you'll need anything and take care. Thanks for watching.